video we're going to take a look at how to tint or basically get any flesh tone that you want with these hands. Um, now these are all vector based and so I'm inside of Flash. I'm currently using the CC uh, 2014 version but in this particular technique it really doesn't matter what version. This is a very basic process. So I'm going to go ahead and uh, I, I already copied this one and moved it over into a folder and what I did is I gave it a movie clip name. I just named it Woman's Hand. It really doesn't matter. It doesn't even matter what the dimensions are. I'm just trying to get it separate from the rest just so I can focus on this. And now what I want to do is I've, um, I want to double click into it like I've done here and I broke everything apart. So I have this control B or command B on the Mac. And so I, what I want to do is I want to isolate on a separate layer all of the flesh and finger notes. So I'm going to shift, hold down the shift key and I've clicked and you see this checkerboard pattern. You want to go ahead and that's more like a polka dot pattern but you want to uh, go ahead and select all of the flesh tones there and just kind of get everything and if you miss something we can come back and get it uh, you can see that there's a bunch of different pieces here but looks like I've got everything I'm going to go ahead and cut it control X and it does all I have left is a black outline so I'm going to go ahead and make a new layer and throw that behind the black outlines and I'm going to control shift V into place and now I've got that by itself and so next thing is while I've still got it selected I'm gonna go ahead and turn that into a movie clip so convert to symbol or F8 okay so I'm just gonna it doesn't really matter what you call it I'm gonna call it woman's flesh about um, <laughs> uh, sounds a little racy but anyways so there there we go so now it's a movie clip and now what I can do is I can go into the properties panel and I can tint it and so um, I don't know what uh, the you know might um, get in trouble with the whole Redskins name thing right now, but we want to do something obviously, you know, maybe in first of all You can go with something that's kind of crazy like, you know, that dark brown and then you can pull back that tint and Get it to be something that's a little bit more realistic And so that's the way you can really just kind of do just about any tint that you want and you know as I made a joke in the video, you know Martian or you can do you know Veruca salt um, and so forth and so you can really kind of just go for it after you do this and, and just kind of go for any tone that you're looking for and you, know, you can start with something that's extreme like a you know like a some sort of any one of these colors and then you can do it now you you also have the ability to use something like the um, there's these this advanced thing but I don't like to do it it's it's less you know first of all in most skin tones I can get everything I need in a tint and secondly, the advanced is, well, it's advanced, and you kind of need to know what you're doing, or it's just kind of a time pit. So there you go. Um, very easy. Once you get it uh, in this movie clip, you can copy and paste it into your whiteboard animations, whether you're using it, doing them in Flash, or um, wherever you're going to use them. And so have fun with that.